I have no, these noticeable bumps, pockets of fat next to my lips that sag down. I was wondering if this could be an extension of my buccal fat pad or it's something else. So, as you can see in the picture, the patient has a little bit of choppiness, but also has a little bit of fullness next to the corners of the mouth. She's wondering if that is buccal fat pad or something else. So in this case, the fullness that is in the lower anterior cheeks is, yes, is secondary to the buccal fat pads. that are pockets of fat that enlarge with age or are genetically determined to be large and causes fullness. But there is a difference. There is a little bit of fullness next to the corners of the mouth. When it's really close to the corner of the mouth, that is no buccal fat pad. That's usually the muscle that controls the mouth. In this corner of the area, there is an accumulation of muscle that is called the modiolus. And in some people, that accumulation of muscle is a little bit enlarged. So in this case, it is important to do a full physical exam. We need to touch the cheeks, do a palpation to determine what is the specific area of concern of the patient. Because if it is the lateral portion or more outside, Buccal fat removal could be the option, but if it is a little bit more inside that is the muscle, buccal fat removal is not going to be the solution.